The narcissistic parent will destroy your life. The narcissistic parent sees you as their competition. They see you as someone who is striving to win or gain something by establishing superiority over them. So they will intentionally hold you back in life. They will intentionally prevent and restrict your progress and development. They see you as an extension of them. They see you as a mirror to themselves. So if you're doing well in life, it reflects back to them that you're better than them. It reflects back to them that they're not enough. So they try to lessen and reduce the reflection in that mirror. They try to break it down. They hate to see you getting compliments from other people. They hate to see you receiving praise and admiration. They will later punish you for that. But you can't get them to see sense. Because they will never listen to you. They have a delusional self-image. They're very boastful and entitled. So they believe that you're inferior. They believe that you're less than them. So they see no reason to listen to you. They believe that whatever they think is of the utmost importance. So they don't see anything wrong in holding you back in life. They might take credit for your accomplishments, but they will never help you get to where you need to be unless there's something in it for them. If they see you succeeding in something, they will try to cause you to change course or direction. But if they can't stop you, they will take credit for your success. Because they see you as their direct competition. They see it as though you're trying to be better than them. So they will try to stop you. They're very envious and jealous. So they will try to hold you back. They will constantly punish you for any compliments you receive. They will try to make you insecure, which is the essence of jealousy, because they fear that someone or something might take you away from them. It results in you being afraid of receiving compliments. It results in you being afraid of success, because then you know that the punishment is coming. But whether you're really good or bad, it doesn't really matter. Because either way, they will still discard you. They will abandon you. But even then, it doesn't end. Because now you have been primed for abuse. You're used to being put down whenever you receive a compliment, which then sets you up to attract a relationship partner who is also narcissistic, who acts the same way as the narcissistic parent. 
which may seem familiar to you. It may be comfortable. But the only reason you're in that relationship is because you have a narcissistic parent, which means that it was completely out of your control. It was inevitable because you can't control who your parents are, which means you can't choose who you end up in a relationship with. Because you're used to being treated bad. It's all you've ever known. It's what you're used to. If you have a narcissistic parent, you need to cut them off. You need to go no contact. Because it's not going to benefit you in any way. They're only going to hold you back. But if you can't do that, you can go low contact. Only talk to them as needed. But it may also be difficult for you to do that because everyone else may like the narcissistic parent. They may not see them the way you do, which means that you were the scapegoat child because you were blamed for everything. You took all of the abuse but despite everything they did to you, the narcissistic parent will still blame you for leaving them because they believe that you owe them simply for existing. They believe that you have an obligation to repay something in return for what they did for you. Even if all they did was set you back in life, they're very arrogant and entitled. They expect you to see it as a privilege to be around them. They believe that they've done so much for you. So now you owe them your life. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.